Welcome back everybody to another episode of Banished with me, Vapor, and welcome to Colonial Charter 1.6.2. Yes, <laughs> we've uh, swiftly moved on from 1.61 to 1.62, um, which I don't think's out for the general public just yet, but there's a, there's a couple of fixes in there. Um, I'll probably read them out in a second, but the most important fix of them all is something that I asked for, and that is a ghost camel, because <laughs> I wanted some camels for my desert, and there wasn't any camels before. And one of the good things is, I asked um, in the past, after doing my zoo, if we could have some that went diagonally, so now we can actually put them diagonal, only the camels so far, um, because it just gets a little bit, when you, you're placing them and they're literally at those kind of right angles, it gets a little bit boring, so now I can place my camels um, in different directions. Also, while we're in here, you'll notice the uh, the crane. So we can now place some cranes down, <clears throat> which also go at diagonals, which is quite useful. And there's various different ones, so if you really want to make like a, a quarry or a proper dock area, there's just so many more things you can use now. So at some point, we'll probably use those. I don't, I don't quite know how I'm going to do a dock area with this river. I might, somewhere along the line, tweak the river just a little bit, just to bring it in a little bit more, if I can. I'm not sure if I can, because I have some tools, and we'll see what we can do. I don't want to change it too much. Only what I would consider reasonable. Um, there's reasonable things you can do with construction. I mean, potentially I could move the, this mountain here, but I'd probably be more prone to move my forester eventually. Which, are they actually chopping trees? No, let's switch that back on. <clears throat> what else? Right, actually, if I um, if I get my phone, look in my email, and we'll actually go through what um, Alguerg told me that we have. Where is it? Um, if I was prepared, I probably would have had this up straight away. But here we are. Okay, so there is a, a one by one small gate. Now, I'm going to assume... That's in here somewhere. Aha, yes there is. Where, where, where's our town? It's uh, quite clear up here. We can see what we're doing. Let me just slow the game down, actually. Just to one time, so nothing crazy happens. Um, where were we? Fences. Okay. And it locked. Aha! That's just what we need. Because I think in the past, I've used probably one of these and yeah I've, I've fiddled around with it to, just to get kind of a gate in, in oh he's put it on everything has he oh no this was always here what are we looking for so there's actually was this always on here it was just that the gate never closed okay but okay so it's the main fence that has just the one by one gate, which which is kind of cool. I can use that in, in other areas. Uh, there's a transparent stockpile ah typo, so I'm guessing that will have been fixed. I also picked up another typo uh, in the crane. For those of you that were really watching closely, um, crane was spelt wrong. <laughs> Someone's fingers slipped on the keyboard, um, but that one's already been fixed. Just not in the update I've got. Uh, so sturdy stone wall diagonals as well, which I'm guessing we didn't have before. That's the wrong one. It's this one. Excellent. And it's different lengths as well, which I'm pretty sure weren't there before. Sturdy stone wall arch wide. Okay, so this is the old one. We've got a slightly, a slightly wider one, which come in handy as well. Um, ghost cranes, which we've already looked at. Um, diagonal boats. Now, <laughs> in the town that I've got, we're not going to see many boats, but for those of you that have got the space, again, it's all about that right angle. Apart from one of them, one of them was uh, always diagonal, but hitting the F key, is it? No? How do we make it diagonal? Right, that's diagonal. Aha, there we go. You just keep rotating through them. Fair enough. So they do come up as you keep hitting the F key. Don't remember that one being in it before. It's got a little man in there as well. <laughs> okay. What else do we have? Um, a dock bridge. Ooh. 
And that could be quite useful. Now, the bridge, and it's not going to be in here, I wonder. Tunnel, a dock bridge. Let's have a look. I'm not going to know what that looks like until I actually build it, am I? Well, they're not doing anything at the moment. Let's chuck one in just so we can see what that looks like. Yeah, we've got the ground square triangle corners. As you can still tell, my nose is a little bit banged up. So we have this before, which I've never used, which I could technically, I think, place on top of the roads. Just to have a different look, so you can have any roads you want. But there's now the diagonal corner pieces, which will be useful as well, for those of you that are a little bit OCD. Um, trade boats to the boats, we've just seen that. Ghost rocks, could it be re removed? Now, yeah, I had this issue in my previous one, and Kralyug did spot it. So if I put this in... Um, we couldn't delete it, we couldn't get rid of it, so we'll leave that to build and, and see how that's done. I don't know if it's just going to have a little kind of trash can in the top corner or not, but we'll see. Um, little icon, chart tweak, Taylor building and Taylor Professor mismatch, is that going to be somewhere in here maybe? Possibly, I'm not too sure what that one is. Something to do with a logging barge which I've never used. Double fuel cart storage. Okay, well, I don't tend to use those, but I probably will do at some point. Okay, that's probably in the traders, isn't it? Where are we? Um, you can tell I don't use some of these things very often. Yeah, so it's probably probably this one. That's kind of a nice model, actually. Quite like that. Soybean to vegetable oil conversion at oil price. Never done that before either, so for those of you that are interested. Um, chickpea texture has been fixed. The logging barge model has been changed as well. A visual bug of broccoli not appearing in the basket on harvest. Chickens give eggs faster. Leghorns reproduce slightly faster. A wire gate with open middle. Well, we were looking at the, uh, the fences earlier. And last but not least, the ghost camel. Which is the most important part, obviously. So yeah, that's just a summary of uh, 1.6.2. I was going to say 3 then for some reason. So yeah, <clears throat> there's quite a few uh, positive changes in there. So what are we at now? We've got dry goods are full. So what else is making dry goods? Because are these dry goods? That's food. Fire bundle is fuel, isn't it? So what that... Okay. Maybe we should just increase that a little bit. Got to be very careful though because we haven't got a lot of space yet storage wise. Right, let's speed the game up. So what I've done is I've put a couple of houses over here which need lumber. Ah, oh, do you know what? we're going to have to tackle this lumber issue? We can't just depend on the trader um, because I think they were salt box houses. <clears throat> Also, we've got our first little animal pen. Uh, oh, that reminds me, yeah, he, uh, Kralyug also said that we can put animals in here. I think it's probably better on the ghost one, actually. So where's the cow? There we are. So if you wanted to put a few more in here. And I also stated that I couldn't click on this building very easily. It's anywhere where the path is for the road. So if I try to click in the middle, which is naturally what one would do, it wouldn't work because that's the space for the roads. So if I click either side, which is working, but if I click the middle, it's a little bit more difficult. But that's fine. At least we know it's not a bug. It's, it's working as intended. And he also asked why I had not put any animals in here because it was designed in a way to kind of have animals in it. And I never even thought about it. Actually, I tell a lie. I did think about it. <laughs> I did wonder why there was no animals in. So we could just like... Get some horses in here. Um, is there any more horses? Is that a horse as well? Yes, I want some different colour ones. What have we got here? And there we go. That's a Shetland pony, I think, isn't it? Excellent. <laughs> it's all in the details. Um, oh God, I've got to stop saying that. That's Kralyug's freight. Not Kralyug. Wow, I'm getting mixed up with my people today. Who am I thinking of? Who says that? Well, there's a little trash can that I was referring to. I'm sure his name begins with a K, and that's probably why I said Kralyug. Mm, Kralis, there we go. <clears throat> Not a million miles off, it's, it began with a K. Okay, we don't need that. 
Yeah, he's, he says that a lot, and I watch um, a lot of his videos, so <laughs> I guess it's rubbed off on me a little bit. Right, let's look at Lumber then, because that's one of the things. Oh, um, Choctaw asked about my uh, forestry. He says, well, they only ever plant these palm trees, and it is a palm tree one. So if you look in here, so you've got the hardwood and the hardwood forest. So you've got bamboo wood, palm trees, which we're using new trees and then just the original one so yeah I could change it if I wanted to but it just makes sense to stick with the palm trees in this one um, right bundling shed okay never used that before right it's the sawmill that we need isn't it to make lumber is it me or is that building different or maybe I just never used that texture before I think this one will be better. <clears throat> I think, just, I, I don't want to be taking up too much of their area, but I think we're going to move this chap at some point. I think we will drop that in here. And we need some more stockpiles, don't we, really? Um, I'm having so much trouble finding things these days. I, don't, I think it's because I've got so much more on the menu. Right, so we need probably a wood one for this guy so he isn't going to walk so far. So let's, let's really think about this one carefully. I'm going, to, I'm going to move this. I think if we do a... I don't know. Yeah, 5x5 five five, and then a general one as well. Just um, leave a bit of space. Oh, here we go. Whoops. Flatten this tiny little bit here. Once they chop that away. Thank you. Are we full on food? Food, 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 food. Yes, wow. Okay. I have to check how much we're using first before I decide to increase that. Because there's no point at the moment. Right, so there. Leave a space. Maybe, maybe about there. Okay. <clears throat> what else have I done? I think I did a little tool storage here as well, so he hasn't got to walk too far. We got a little stockpile there. <clears throat> Everyone just kind of lingering around the uh, chapel. I'm sorry about clearing my throat a lot as well. I, I might actually edit it out of the the final video. Then again, I might not. Could call it laziness, but um, <laughs> it's not laziness. It's just that kind of. I like the. Although I'll, I kind of like this to be a little bit professional where I can. I kind of like just the more natural, rough and ready kind of human touch to it. And some videos are really polished, but I like that little bit of, kind of, yeah, a little bit of roughness. These buildings are really nice. And I just noticed you can upgrade them to, it's the same, but like different bricks and things. So we might toy around with that a little bit. Okay, why is this one log fuel limit? Must be a material limit. Yep, okay. Let's just increase that. There we go. So that should solve some of those problems. We've got this ready as well now. So this is going to provide us with some wool. We'll chuck someone in there. And we can unpause this as well. So what are we getting out of here at the moment? Milk and leather. So that should mean, slowly but surely, At this place will start to make more clothes and I wonder because I can't remember if there is a cart or some kind of storage just for leather it probably isn't oh somebody's died is that the first person that's died I think it might be oh no two people have died oh dear it's all gonna start now <laughs> the problems are gonna kick in um, protein dry goods Is leather classed as a dry good? Hmm. That's a question. Clothing and tools. Let's try it and see. Let's see what happens. So I'm not sure. Actually, let's put the... I think the basement isn't there for dry goods. 
tool, clothing. Yeah, let's try it out and see. I think we can just about make that look right. Trader, what have we got? Cows? Yeah, we don't really need any animals at the moment, do we? So. Food, yeah, that's what we're going to check. Let's have a look on our town hall. Okay. Um, here, isn't it? So, 3,000. Okay, so we... Yeah, we do need to increase that. So, food we'll put to 10,000. Because, obviously, once, once these get built, we're going to... We need more food, and I think families. Yeah, they start. <laughs> the families are running away with it, and I'm, I'm not keeping up with the houses. What we might do, though, we might actually build a bigger school shortly. Town hall, church. We really need to kind of plan this area out. Start moving forward with it. Here we. Go. Go. So we got our farm supply coming in, which will be useful for the crops. Not that I'm quite sure which crops I need yet. Let's try out some of the new stuff. Um, what's this? Okay. Got some different statues that we can use as well. Brilliant. Let's have a look at the one. Kind of like that. I'm just tempted. I wonder if. Hmm. I think what we'll do is put a couple of these on here. I think we'll go, yeah, we'll go with the fence. I was just kind of contemplating whether or not to put like a hedge kind of going around, but. Let's just have a good think about how we're going to do this. I think we'll use that and the corner piece, like so. Let's give you two, two, three. That's weird. I should have been able to get that in. Again, two there. there we go. It's not going to work on this side because of where I've got the road. I could move the road, I guess, to keep things kind of uniform. And the question is... Hmm, I think... Yeah, we'll do it slightly different. Let's put this all the way across first. I think what we'll do is... If I put the corner piece here, though, will it look... Yeah, it looks like it's going into the side of the house, so that's fine. I can live with that. The corner piece down here. And two little pieces like that. What we could do, although <coughs> there's not going to be a lot of vegetation, I suppose, on this map because of the, the heat. We can probably get away with... At least a little bit, I think. Where's the corner piece? What am I looking for? This one. If we do something like this. And the half one. It's kind of separating the, the two houses. Well, well, it'll be three houses altogether, I guess. Let them build that, and we'll see how it is. Okay, what have we got here? Why is my trading post not got anybody? Uh -huh. Did I build another building? Maybe I did. So we need another person in there. So what are we getting out of here at the moment? Lots of wool. So potentially, this is going to give us feathers, isn't it? Why does that keep... I built another. Aha! Uh -huh. It's this place, isn't it? Come on. And the 
same with this one. It's on one. I'll fix that. So if we got wool and leather coming in, potentially we can switch what we're actually making. Or we could even switch to wool coats. We'll just kind of see how the materials are actually doing. Could probably do with putting a couple more of these things in. I mean, that's, a, that's a fair amount of wool, but it depends how much they actually use to make cloves. Got a lot of milk, so potentially we could do some kind of dairy thing as well. I think we need to, need to make some more steps forward, though. Right, okay. So we know we need a lot more houses. Let's have a zoom out. Let's get a market in. I wonder if... Do we go with... I think, you know what, we're going to go with both. We're going to go with some of these buildings, and we're going to go with a, what I'm going to now call a retro market. <laughs> um, let's see, have we got any new ones? Small, edibles. I do like this model, by the way. It's really nice. Whoa, whoa, where's the central one? There it is. I'm not a big fan of the building on that one, though. See, I'm, I'm going to use this one, because I think it'll just fit in a bit better. Right, so if we... This is pure guesswork, by the way. Oh, I've got the little market there. I forgot about that one. Um, actually, let's keep that with inside that river. There we go. And then we'll put some of the new market buildings around there and we'll start building up some of the houses. Not too many houses, I don't think, though, because we've got to think how far it is for people to walk. And then, once that's working, I think we can start working on our town centre. I don't need any of that. Oh, it's just starting to come together. I might even put some palm trees in here. Do I put any grass? I don't think so. I could change the sand, because I think we have some different sands, don't we? Let's see, well, that's colours. So we've got... This is probably the same as that by the looks of it. It's got like darker sands see what the different ones look like. I'm pretty sure that is the same. But that will come in useful anyway because if I'm putting this in here it will stop um, other trees and things from growing in here which we don't want. But I want to see what these ones look like anyway. So we'll do both of those. You're a little bit short on logs probably because of this chap so Let's yeah, let's stop this one for now. Because we don't want tons and tons of lumber. That'll do us for now. Because these guys have got to keep up. Have we built the... Uh, okay, so the dry goods has got reeds at the moment. Huh. Considering all the leather we're getting, you'd think... How much we've actually got in stock? Let's have a look. Lever is seven. Yeah, not a lot. Quite annoying, isn't it? <laughs> At least it's no winter. Because that that would be a real downer. So we've got stone, we've got a slow amount coming in. Iron we're fine for at the moment. But I think, yeah, I think I'm going to leave it right there because we've got some, some extra houses in along here now. We're starting to develop this area. I think what we'll do is I'll make sure before the next episode that everything that's building is built and we will start our work on pigs. No, thank you. No, we won't start work on pigs. We will start working on this kind of market area and then I'm not sure. And I think I probably will go with it, but whether or not to keep this as like the town centre. I think we probably should. I'm a bit bothered by this mountain, but we'll keep it. This we can probably get rid of as well, because it was only there temporarily. But I'm not sure if that'd be quite the right place to have the town centre. Because just in the thinking about it, we've already got some food production and things going on here. Although I could move it. Yeah, I think we might move the town centre, but we'll get the market built and I'll make sure all this is ready to go. 
So, until next time, as always, take care.